William, hello, how are you? Teacher, teacher. Hello, how are you doing? You better? Yes, teacher. Nice, that's nice. Thanks, Great. Thanks. Good, teacher. Very good. That's excellent. So happy to know that you are doing better, my friend. Thanks. Uh, all day, Sunday, to rest. Really, you were resting all Sunday? To rest all day. Great. In eating, in eating a lot, a lot of food. <laughs> that's nice, that's nice. I mean, yes, usually when we are resting, we eat a lot. Yeah, that's great. Okay, good, good, good. So my, my day in work, very, very easy. Oh, really? Pesado, como sería? No, heavy. Heavy, heavy. You my say day heavy, work. heavy, or other manera. You can say heavy, or you can say hard. A hard day at work. A hard at day at work. Like this, look. A hard day at work. A hard day at work. Okay, just let me know. Let me text your classmates that it's time. Salí tarde, ¿cómo sería? How do you say? I left my job. I checked out late. I checked out late. You say I, it like this. I, I checked out late. Check out a late in my work. You just say like that. I checked out late, and we understand that is. Ella se entiende que es de trabajo. I checked out late. Okay. Really, what time did you finish working today? Uh, este twenty minutes. Oh, after after him, after the this five the end. usual the usual time yes yeah, oh, really well, time yeah. well but 20 minutes is not that much i mean 20 minutes can be seen as understandable 20 minutes is a little bit like not that much. It's not it's very. One. It's not very late. No es tan tarde. But the good thing is that you are here in class. You arrive home early. I imagine you go to a casa, right? It takes you like twenty minutes. You told me, no? Yes, yes. Oh, yeah. That's fine. Fifteen minutes. <laughs> okay, you know. That's cool. That means that. You were home early, you could relax, and you're ready for the class, right? That's good, teacher. Excellent. Welcome to the class, William. Nice Thanks, talking teacher. to you. Shanira. Hello, Shanira. Shanira. Hey. Come on, Janita, where is your camera? I use my phone, teacher, I'm sorry. You still haven't been able to go get a new camera? I'm sorry, teacher. I, uh, well, it was a interesting weekend. I uh, really... What did you do? Tell me. Work, work and work. And 
Yesterday, no. Uh, on, on Saturday? Yes. I had, how do you say, Dolor de Espalda? Back. Headache? Backache. Backache. Back? Eight. Eight. Yeah, backache. Backache. And today, when I when when I went to walk with my dogs, uh, I hurt my my knee. Ooh, so sorry. Yeah, yeah. And th then was a uh, a bad beginning of. I'm here working, but ready for begin to. To learn more in this class. That's good. That's good. I like that attitude, even though it's been hard for you. Yeah, <laughs> it's okay, teacher. Uh, something happened. I hope more lay will later. Will be later. Rain. later. It will. I hope. Uh, look, you gotta say it like this. Look, I okay. hope. It will rain okay. later on tonight. Okay, the proper expression is like this. Look, okay. I hope it will rain later on tonight. Okay, perfect. I hope, I hope it will rain later on tonight. Yes, I hope. Okay. Me too, me too. I hope it will rain later because, gosh, it's hot. Terribly yes, hot. I use my my fan because today is very hot. Yeah, I I also got my fan working and I'm like oh, desperate. It's pretty hot. Yeah, today. me too. Be, be, before before working or after, I forgot this word. <laughs> uh, después. After. Before. Uh, after. 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 After work with my my dogs. Oh yeah, I imagine. I mean, exercising with this weather. Oh, terrible. And, and I took a big dinner. Then, Jesus, I'm really. I don't know how do you say. Embotado, lleno. How do you say this word, teacher? Mm -hmm. That's weird. I have never, I mean, I feel discomfort, but that expression, embotado. I mean, <laughs> I have general? never, no, but. Really? You, you feel a discomfort, right? Yeah, because you when you eat a lot. Yeah, but I mean, Hmm. Yeah, I have never used it in English. <laughs> I mean, it's a homework for you, teacher. <laughs> yeah, because I mean, I can say, yeah, I feel a little discomfort in my stomach. I feel full, like, I mean, bloat. Very full of food? Maybe? Bloat. Let me see. I'm thinking about a, a synonym of that. Because, I mean, blunted is. No, but that's different. Blue is something different. Hmm. Yeah, it would be bloated. Because you mean that you are inflammed, right? Yeah. Okay. What you are talking about is this. This expression, I know. You are talking about that you have a bloated stomach bloated yes ah bloated a bloated stomach i don't know yeah maybe oh, stop it. i ate a beef bread with chicken i don't know is the expression in english but you know Pan con pollo, a big yeah. bread no, with that's, okay, okay, okay. 
let's see. You ate a truffle bread with chicken. Man, you are really getting onto my vocabulary. You got a stuffed bread with chicken. Stop, <laughs> relleno. Yeah, stuffed bread with chicken. Okay. No, I don't like that. I, I know, teacher. Uh, okay. It's weird. Something that you like it. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You have Actually, a, a weird, uh, how do you say, gustos? Taste. Taste, okay. Yeah. Do you have a, a, a very weird taste? Taste. Yeah, I'm a little bit difficult with that. Why, is a, is a custom or you change your taste in, in, in the life? Well, actually, now I eat meat. I didn't used to eat meat. But you prefer younger, this, or, or, or you change because your your parents uh, learn it in this form? No, actually, they raised me eating almost everything. Okay. I had to eat almost everything, but I when I could decide, I mean, I could back on meat. carnes. I mean, I. I like meat, but just little pieces. I, I don't like big portions. That's not for me. And it's weird because I love I love rice. I love eating rice. That's something that I can eat a lot. I recommend you Soho then because they are a delicious bowl of rice. Oh yeah, yeah I mean. I can eat a big bowl of rice. Yeah. Like and white rice for me is mm, delicious. And what do you prefer? Uh, white rice or fried? White, white, white rice. Weird, weird. That's, that's <laughs> my favorite. That's my favorite. But I can eat rice in almost any fashion, but soup. Okay, okay. Yeah, but I mean, white rice is my favorite. Nice. Some, uh, por lo menos? At least. At least one food is your favorite teacher. Oh, yeah. I mean, I eat it a lot of, uh, well, actually, I like uh, green pepper stuff with meat. Oh, okay. It's a delicious food, yeah. yeah. I love that. I love that. For me, that's oof, something pretty special. With what kind of, with, with kind of meat? Chicken, pork, or? Any, any meat, any meat. When it's a green pepper, any meat will do. Okay, okay. I just love it. Well, Welcome to the class. Nice talking to you, Janira. <laughs> Thank you, teacher. Let's see, Mr. Osorio. Hello, how are you? Hi, teacher. Uh, a little bit tired, teacher. Oh, really? A hard day at work? Uh, yes, it was a pretty, pretty busy day, teacher. And today I took my wife and my oldest daughter to get the first dose of the COVID vaccine. And then I went back to, to work the rest of the day and some activities accumulated. Accumulated. Yeah, was yeah accumulated during the day. Accumulated. And I, I spent very busy. Okay. Yeah, I can imagine. I mean, it's a problem when we have uh, something to do and all the, we get a backlog, we get a backlog of work. Yes, and then I had to drive from, uh, I went to, to the hospital of the East Regional and then to a, to another medical unit and to schedule some how do you say citas 
uh, appointment. Okay. Uh, uh, another to schedule some appointments and and I have to drive a lot and and that makes me a little tired, teacher. I imagine. I mean, whenever yes. I drive a lot, I'm like tired. Well, when I drive a lot in San Salvador because traffic is ah, terrible. it's terrible the traffic. Yeah, but if I if I drive out of San Salvador, for me it's okay. But in San Salvador, man, it's hard. Besides that, the fact is that uh, both our cars they are stick. Do you know that expression? Stick, not uh, Okay, both our cars are manual. Manual, ah, okay. <laughs> so they it are feels not, they are some not, pain they in the in the in leg or yeah, it's uh, terrible, man. The clutch legs gets tired. Uh, I drive a microbus. And the clutch is so hard to, uh, how do you say, presionar, to press? Push, to push. To push, okay, teacher, to push. And I feel a, a little pain. Well, sometimes I mean, sometimes I, I drive a sedan that the clutch is soft. The, the SUV we got, it's a little bit hard. You have a SUV, teacher. Yeah, but I'm old one, my friend. <laughs> you, have, uh, you have a lot of money, teacher. No, I don't. And then we got uh, uh, also, there's a pickup available here at home, and that pickup is hard. Ah. That one is hard. I have driven that car from here to, wow, everywhere Santa Ana, Sonsonate, Ruta de las Flores, and what Usulutan? Man, that's terrible. <laughs> because it's a it's a it's a Nissan Harbari. Man, oh, those pickups are car. Hard. It's Harbari, <laughs> yes. Yes, I know it is. It's a, a good car teacher. Yeah, but man, to drive that is hard. Yes. Uh, how do you say acostumbrarse? Get used to it. Ah, okay. Get used to, to drive that car, teacher. Yeah, I mean, to drive that car is hard. Believe me, it's hard. And the problem is that when they take that car out of San Salvador, the only one who they ask to drive is me. Siempre que que salir para San Salvador. In that car, they just ask me to drive it. Man, it's terrible. Yes. In my opinion, teacher, I... I used to to drive the automatic. I prefer it. Yeah, it's more comfortable. It's more comfortable, yes. You're yeah, right. Let, it's me, let me see. Me, I have held just one. Just one of the cars I have held was automatic. The rest, they have been, all of them have been standard. So, ah. Uh, yeah, sometimes it's easy, sometimes it's been hard, but it's cool. I mean, as I tell you, driving out of San Salvador for me is okay, but driving in the in traffic downtown, man, that's horrible. Yes, it's when I, when when someone needs to 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 learn, it's better than stick car. Yeah. Yeah, actually it is. Right now my son is learning. He's learning. Ah. He's learning how to drive. But the problem is this. He's learning in the SUV, but actually his car is going to be the sedan. Ah, yeah. There's no problem with, with that teacher. Ooh, well, that's a little bit different because remember the SUV, the motor, the engine is a 2.0 and the sedan is a 1.3. Okay, so, under, I, I get it, teacher. I I understand you. Yeah, there's a difference when you want to start to start up. The startup is the complex one. Yes, you're right. And in, 
In traffic jams, remember, that's a whole different story. Yeah. <laughs> and how do you say el levantón? <laughs> the startup. The startup, okay. So see, the startup is, is more difficult. Yeah, it is. It's terrible. It's terrible. I mean, but you I need to, to, to be careful. Okay. Yeah, I prefer to teach him that instead of because he wanted to learn how to ride a motorcycle, but I didn't want to give him the motorcycle. Uh, eh, me quedé en la luna, teacher. Quería preguntarle he, si he usted también to... puede manejar motocicleta. Yeah, I have one. Ah, I, I broke I broke my hand two months three months ago riding that motorcycle. Uh, for that reason, you you are in 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 therapies. Yep, that's why <laughs> I understand. And and how many cc is your uh, that motor? Oh, that one is small, man. It's just a uh, 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 one fifty. Oh, okay. actually, actually, I want I want right now a three sixty. My brother has a, a seven seven fifty. How do you say seven fifty? Yes, seven fifty. Seven fifty has Suzuki SX GSX. Oh. The, other day yeah, I tried, I, the other day I tried my sister in law's husband motorcycle. El otro día probé la de mi el esposo de mi cuñada. My sister. My sister's in love husband. He's got the, a 360 BMW. Man, it's so Oh, cool. it's beautiful. <laughs> BMW. Yeah. I like that, that motorcycle teacher. Hey, it's beautiful. Smooth. That motorcycle is pretty smooth. Yes. But Interesting talk to you, teacher. Yeah, but they don't want me riding one like that because they say that I'm going to crash because I love speed. Yes. I mean, I love riding. <laughs> I understand. But, but for me, I mean, in motorcycle, the fastest I have gone is like 160, 180. In a motorcycle. It's nice and dangerous. Yes. Yes, oh, you need nice to be talking careful. to you, Jose. Thank you, teacher. Welcome to the class. No, thanks to you. Thank you. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Who else is around? Fernando, hello, Fernando. How are you? Hi, teacher. I'm fine. Everything's okay. fine. Everything's fine? Ooh. Yes. How was everything. your day? Well, how was your weekend? Tell me, did you finish everything? Would you relax during the weekend? Yes, my, my weekend was relaxed. I Saturday I was with my, I went with my children to the swimming class in the morning. Oh, really? They can swim? Yes. In they 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 learn they they learn they're learning. They are they learning. I think they are learning. Oh, yes. That's nice. That's nice. So it was it was a, a beautiful experience uh, because I always have to work uh, regularly every time I I went with them. But yeah. this this Saturday I, I went. That's nice. I mean, it's good and it's a good exercise. A pretty good exercise. Yes, it's a good exercise. After that, we we went to it because. It's a hard exercise and um, this uh, despierta el apetito. Yeah, yeah, I mean it. Uh, how do we say that? It's uh, it awakes actually. It awakes your appetite. Oh, awake. Yeah, or colloquially you say it gets you hungry. Yes. Uh, Colloquially, in but in a formal way, you say it awakes. Awakes the, yeah, the appetite. Despertar. 
No, okay. And the other four? We we get hungry. No, it gets you hungry. It gets you hungry. It gets you hungry. But in, in our case, are we? No, actually, you say like that. Man, you know, uh, I did a lot of exercise. And it gets me hungry. Or you can say like that. It gets you, you know, it gets you hungry. Exercising gets you hungry. It gets you hungry. A conversation, ah, okay. you use it like that, and you are you are speaking in general. Okay. 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 When you say, when you are saying it like that, uh, you are speaking in general. So that means that you are not referring to just your personal situation. You are saying everybody has the same. To everybody happens the same. Okay? Like you say, okay. oh, drinking coffee gets you away. Mm -hmm. You are coffee speaking in general. You, you are speaking oh. in general. So that means that it happens to everybody or most of the people. No, okay. Okay, always I learn a new phrase. Yeah, no, it's cool, it's cool. I mean, I like that, guys. I like that. We can practice a lot. Right now, you know, Fernando, I am sort of, uh, I am sort of pissed off with uh, with one of your classmates who was supposed to send me a message on Saturday and didn't, you know? Because uh, that person really, really got me pissed off. You know that expression? Piss off. Um, Presional? No. Oh, molesto. Oh. Mad. When you say pissed off, you are saying enojado, molesto. Oh, okay. Piss off. Like, like mad. Yeah, exactly like that. You can say when you're referring to a situation, you can say, man, you know, I love, I love when it rains. But listen to me. But it pisses me off to find to find leaks. It pisses me off. It pisses me it. off to find leaks. Goteras. Man, uh, I love when it rains, <laughs> but when there's a leak, I get like, oh, I hate that. Okay, I understand. You get it? You get how do we use pieces, pieces, piece off? Um, the disorder, yeah, like, it's pieces. Yeah, me no, up. like the disorder pieces you up. Yeah, I understand. It gets me mad also. <laughs> Something that, that really, really pisses me off is when, when the house is dirty. I mean, I cannot see the house dirty. If I come and I and the house is dirty, I mean, I get the broom and start cleaning. Yes, me too. When my house is dirty, I, I clean. Yeah. So I, 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 put, my, I put my playlist I love. Okay, yeah, the same, the same do I do when I got the, when I see the big bunch of laundry. I mean, when the laundry is like this, man, I need to, I need to do the laundry. I cannot see a lot of people, a lot of clothing. I'm sorry. In my in my, in my house, we have a schedule for laundry. Oh, really? Yes. Uh, we have uh, one day of the week for each one. And uh, we try to respect this schedule. That's cool. That's actually nice. No, yes. in my house, you know, use, I, it used to be, it used to be that I used to do the laundry. I mean, everything that was washed by hand, I used to do it on Sundays. Sun, uh, yeah, I used, I mean, I used, I used to like doing my own laundry. Sundays, but everything that washes by hand, because I'm very picky, I'm not any color, so I do it my own. It's like ironing. Yes, in my case, I, I had two um, some clothes that I wash 
by my hand and I wash me. Yeah, it's better. It's better. You avoid yeah, troubles. Because, because, because we don't have a lot of money for buy more. <laughs> yeah, no, I understand it. <laughs> and I mean it. And it's yeah. not that, it's, it's the fact that you like to take care of your stuff. Yeah. yeah, I mean, I, I got I got clothing that is very very old, but I mean, if you take good care of it, it lasts long. It lasts. Hold on. It lasts long. Dura mucho. It lasts long. Dura mucho. Ah, okay. And this clothes and the not uh, for pajama. Yeah, well, now that we are talking personally, to be honest with you, I hate pajamas. I hate beaches. Mm -hmm. I, mean, oh, I hate you them. Just live without, without clothes. Yeah, I Maybe. hate pajamas. <laughs> yeah, if possible, I hate pajamas. I mean, you know, it can, it's weird because it can be pretty cold, pretty cold. But I just cover half of my body and my feet, they need to be out. I cannot sleep if my feet are covered with the blanket. Uh, Did you understand me? Uh, the last part now, blanket. Uh, savanna. Oh, savanna. Oh, okay. Yeah. So my feet, they, they need to be free. No blankets, no salt. Nothing. Nothing. Only fit. They must be. They must be out. Yes, all the time. I cannot cover. Doesn't matter if it's cold. No importa si está helado. But I cannot it's cover. For, the fits are for regular the, the temperature. Yeah, but that's the thing. I love it when it's cold. So, and, but lately the, the the weather is very hot. In, in my case, in, in, in this case, when the weather is very hot, I am feel uncom uncomfortable naked because the, oh, really? the, the see, because in the bed at, at the bedtime because uh, the blanket uh, se me pega. <laughs> I no, 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 it gets it gets actually it gets sticky. Sticky, sticky. Oh, yeah. Okay. Like, like stickers, <laughs> like stickers. Yeah, yeah, that yeah. happens, that yeah. happens. Well, yes. to be honest and with you, and, it, and believe me, it's not that I have a lot of money. It's not that I have a lot of money, but to be honest with you, when it's pretty hot, what I do is that uh, I turn on the air condition like for one or two hours, so the room can cool down mm -hmm. and so I can sleep. But man, I suffer when I have to pay the utilities. That's terrible. In my case, I don't have AC. I had a fun. <laughs> well, no, you know, actually the ACs, uh, when we got the house, they were already installed. Oh. That's why. Otherwise, I wouldn't have it. I mean, they are expensive. It's <laughs> very expensive, right? Very expensive. I, and this is the and reason the because I don't have AC. Yeah, and maintenance is expensive. Yeah. You gotta yeah, be with cleaning time. and everything every four months, five months. You gotta pay a lot. It's terrible. It's yeah, terrible. but it, it, it's necessary in this in this type of weather. Well, they help. Actually, they are not like necessary, but they help. Yeah, but, they, make, uh, they make your life comfortable. Yeah, but lately the the, the weather in the night are very, very hot. It is. In, in my case, I, I, in my in my room I have a window to to the street. So yeah. I I uh la dejo. I left. I yes, I leave it. I leave it open. Uh, I leave it open. I leave it open. Uh, uh, but no, not totally open. Only a little. 
Yeah, just so the air can circulate. Yeah. Oh, I nice okay. talking to you, Fernando. Welcome. <laughs> Thank you, teacher. Okay, guys, I need to get attendance. You ready? Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Let's look, get everything ready. Okay, Ambarel Alfaro Gomez. Present. Thank you, Ambar. Carlos Antonio Murillo Hernandez. Present teacher. Thank you. Claudia Lisette Ramos Barrientos. Present teacher. Thank you. Daniel Eduardo Segueda Valencia. Fernando Martín González Martínez. Francisco Eduardo Figueroa Mejía. Present teacher. José Ernesto Osorio Morán. Present teacher. María Alejandra Barrientos Romero. Present teacher. María Luisa Morales de Corpeño. Present teacher. Marta Ana Belinda Morales de Portillo. Present teacher. Néstor Omar López Castro. Present teacher. Nicolás Atilio Méndez Granados. Roxana Iveta Asensio de Mejía. Present. Silvia Elizabeth Avendaño Pineda. Susana Beatriz Ortiz de Cornejo. Present teacher. Walter Mauricio Morales Araujo. Present teacher. Wilfredo Guardado Rivera. Present teacher. Thank you. William Giovanni Rosales Galvez. Present teacher. Sanira Elizabeth Asensio García. Present teacher. Marcela Margarita Fuentes Muila. Thank you. Jensi Elizabeth Miranda de Odanes. Present teacher. Thank you. Fabiola Georgina Silva. Present. Thank you. Let's see. Present teacher, sorry. No problem, Fernando. Thank you very much. Okay, let me continue. Guys, before anything else, uh, Hello to everybody. Uh, today and tomorrow is going to be a lot of, uh, actually a lot of speaking. We are going just to see a small grammar point, but mostly these next three classes are going to be mostly speaking, okay? Starting Thursday, we are going to start working a little bit more with the, with the manual, but these classes are going to be speaking. So. I take longer with every one of you. So the rest, you need to be like paying attention to pronunciation and to vocabulary. Because if you notice, we are increasing the level of vocabulary and the type of vocabulary we are using. So it's very important because I'm getting focused more like in modicums or common expressions. And also I'm focusing on colloquial English, okay? so. Pay attention, it's actually very interesting because we are getting new vocabulary. Ambar, hello, how are you, my dear? Hello, teacher, good evening. Oh, come on, Ambar, I heard you like, ah, hello. Come on, you're resting, you're fine. Yes. And it's raining hard. I, I don't hear you very well because in my house it's raining very hard. In mine too. I mean, it's raining cats and dogs. Yes. <laughs> so, Amber, tell me, what about your weekend? How was it? Uh, I'm, I'm fine. Uh, I, I could, I could make some things. Uh, how do you say? Pude hacer mis pendientes. Okay. I could do my my errands. I could oh, really? do my my, my errands. errands. My my errands. Yes. Um, um, on Saturday, 
and I was working in the morning, in the afternoon. I I went to the mall because I I did my face or I paid oh, some yeah. bills. I pay my bills. I pay my bills, yes. That's the saddest part of the day. <laughs> yes. But uh, I I don't like have doubts. Yeah, of course. Debts. 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 Doubts is do that. Doubts is do that. Debs. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Well, yeah, you know, what can we do? Debs are part of daily life. Yes. Yeah, but I mean, it's good that we have a job and we are able to to, to fulfill all our, all our obligations. Exactly. Yeah. Because... Yes. Tell me, tell me. Sorry, it's really important to me. Uh, for me, it's really important for me. for me. It's really important for me. Uh, I don't have debts and pending with another people. Yeah, I understand you. Yeah, of course. I mean, we don't like to do that. And I just, I mean, some of us owe, some of us owe a lot to the banks. I don't know if they owe to the banks. To the banks, you think? Yeah, I, I owe to the bank, but not that much, just a little bit, tens of thousand dollars. Okay. Of the of the not that much. <laughs> yes. Yeah, but, no big deal, no big deal. I mean, you just don't count with that money. And you are like, I mean, you make do with the rest. Yes. Okay, but tell me, that was the obligation. What about the fun part? What did you do for fun this weekend? Can you repair me, please? It's, I don't hear you very well. For okay. How was the, the obligations part of the weekend? What about the fun part of the weekend? What did you do for fun this weekend? Well, uh, um, I only watched uh, Casa de Papel, but I I don't finish now. I didn't. I didn't finish. Oh, really? Come on, Amber. Yes. I finish it Saturday I finish it. at night. Um, I don't know. Uh, I watch it uh, the, the whole season on I Saturday watched, at night. Uh, by sharp. One uh, by one, by chapters. By, uh, I sharp one by one. No. In my case, you know, I watch them all in a row. Do you, do you made marathon? Or how do yeah. you say? Yeah, I watch them all in a row. I finish it around 2.30 a.m. Yes. And I was like, ah. so do you want me to tell you then? No, you don't want to. <laughs> okay. okay, no, I won't spoil it for you. Don't worry, don't worry. Well, Amber, welcome to the class. Thank you very much. Thank you, teacher. Wilfredo, hello, how are you? I'm very well, teacher. How was the weekend for you? Oh, it was very good. Very, very interesting. Oh, really? What did you do? Um, Saturday in the morning, I, I, I went to pay some bills. Uh. And... I went to the market. Ah, um, it is, it is every every month. I, I need to, to do it. Um, then in the, in, we make a, we prepare the lunch with my son, with my children. 
Okay. In the afternoon at 2 p.m., I went to play soccer to Texas. And my oh, children nice. go with me. Yeah. Went, went with went. me. Yeah, went. Okay, so did you win or did you lose? Yeah, of course, we, we won. Oh, that's cool, that's cool. Three, two, that's one. Yeah. Okay, that's excellent, that's excellent. Yeah. yeah, I remember, let's see, I remember Walter was also going to play soccer on Sunday. I remember on Sunday afternoon, he told me he was going to play soccer. On Sunday, I so, go to, I, I play yes, too. On Sunday, Saturday That's and cool. Sunday. Yeah. Saturday and Sunday. Sunday. Both days. Okay. Yeah. Um, really, now I play only Saturday and Sunday, but um, two months or three months ago, um, before start studying English, I can go to play uh, Monday because oh. we start to play around 9 p.m. But it is That's why very you late. Not. Yeah. Uh, it is yeah, very tired know, too. I used to do that when I was young. When I got a woman, I used to do that. Well, uh, actually, I was not. I didn't used to play soccer. I used to play basketball. Yeah. I used to play Saturday, Sundays, and at least two days on the week, on weekdays. But now, well, now I don't have time. I don't really have time, and I'm too lazy. It is hard to. It is difficult because when um, we work and study, it's difficult because yeah. the time it is it is enough to do these activities. But my my teacher, my first ch child, it is the oldest. oldest. My oldest, oldest, my oldest kid. My oldest kid, but my, I I I have three. What about the second? Is the one in the middle? The one in the middle or my second kill? Oh, okay. But my second kill, he is playing now in the, um, how do you say, Las Menores or Ligas Menores? Oh, really? Yeah, my two years. In the youngsters one? That's cool. That's cool. So he's a very good player. That's nice. He tried to, to be good, but right now it, it, he needs to, to learn so much, but yeah, yeah no way. It's a process. It's a process. Yeah, it is a process. Yeah, but, it's like it's like me. Look, uh, my son last, he's having, he's sparring uh, twice a week. And last week he got an eye like this. Yeah, because he's he's sparring twice a week. So I mean it's normal. They they learn. I mean they are learning, they are practicing in order to become better. Then teacher, this is it was my this this it was my my, my, my weekend was very very interesting because sometimes I, I I don't go to play but I I got to see the match with my That's cool. my oldest. You enjoy you enjoy both things. Yeah, yeah, it is. That's great right for me. Yeah, I want to play. Cool. That's cool. Yeah. Excellent. Welcome. Thank you very much. Thank you to you, teacher. Roxana, hello. How are you? Hi, teacher. I'm fine. Roxana, you gotta stay tonight with me after class, okay? Okay. Mm. <laughs> I'm sorry, I you forget. You owe me. You owe yeah. Me. Yeah, I so forget. So tell me, Roxana, how was your weekend? Tell me, what did you do Saturday afternoon and Saturday night? Please <laughs> tell me. I want to know. <laughs> uh, sar Saturday uh, the afternoon, I went with my mom to the uh, Walmart supermarket. Really? Yeah, and then I went to uh, EPA. Okay. And after that, we uh, had a dinner in Bacabrava. Bacabrava. 
into the oh. effort. And That's nice. Yeah. And Sunday, I stay at home. I was at home at the morning and I went to the Tacos Los Hermanos. Oh, really? Yeah. This oh, yeah, you love Mexican a, food. Yeah. This is a new restaurant. And it was okay. And I went with my best friend and my son. And then we went to Jiao Jiao to take a dessert. And that's it. For some dessert. For some, for dessert. some dessert. For some dessert. And today, I was uh, very busy. Because it was I, very busy. It was very busy because uh, I have a lot of uh, work. And that's it. Now it's raining here and my clothes uh, get, no, se mojó. Got wet. Got, got wet. Got wet. So for that, I just. Uh, okay, wow. tell me, it got wet or soaked through? Got wet, se mojó. Yes, wet or, I'm asking you, it got wet or it got soaked through? Soaked through Soft means through. empapado. Mm, no, oh, get, okay. got wet. Oh, Took that's wet. But That's now it's nice. raining very hard here. Yeah, but actually it's a it's an electrical storm. I don't know. Uh, uh, yeah, I heard. Yeah, I think I, the, I could even hear it here. <laughs> the weather is very very hot. Yeah, it is. It is. Let's hope it gets better. Yeah. And you, teacher? Well, me. Ooh. Guys, actually, something that happened to me this weekend is going to be part of one activity you are going to perform. Okay. <laughs> no, 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 don't worry. It's something that happened to me personally. Uh, and you are going to help me, guys. Do you remember that we are working with It Will Be Better, right? And Roxana is asking me what happened to me. Well, my weekend was very interesting. Saturday, let's see, Saturday, what, what was I doing on Saturday? Uh, Saturday, Maybe. I went to teach. I went to teach a class in the morning. Then in the afternoon, I was working on the computer. Then I had a meeting and in the afternoon from four to six. After the meeting, while I was looking for, checking out some of my reels that I got, uh, actually mostly related to business English. I was checking out a couple of books that I got there lay, laying down. And let's see, Sunday in the morning I went to work. I was working, but Sunday morning I went to, to make a, an electrical installation. You know, something simple, just a couple of lights and like three or four, uh, electrical outlets, something very simple. And in the afternoon, what's the problem? Uh, my sister called me and asked me, hey, what are you doing? And I was like, ah, I'm just arriving home. And she told me, hey, do you want to come over for some dessert? And I was like, ah, cool. And she told me, bring your family. And I was like, cool, no problem. And I found out that my parents were visiting. Usually my parents visit my sister every Sunday. They have lunch together. So they invited me and I was there and everything was cool, pretty cool, until I saw that my dad was sitting at a table. He had a big cake in front of him and people started singing happy birthday and I forgot that it was my dad's birthday. I didn't know at all, I was like, I even asked, what are you celebrating? And they told me, oh, it's your dad's birthday. And I was like, oh, cool. 
Yeah, I just forgot. So guys, you are going to help me out with that situation. I will set it out later. Luego les explico the activity, but it's going to be fun. Okay, so that was my weekend, Roxana. Not too good. Okay. Did you take yeah. a rest? Why? I will rest when I die. <laughs> okay. Yeah. I really think so. Yeah, why so? <laughs> I mean, I've been quite busy. And I'm going to be very busy this coming week. So, nah, it's okay. I will have vacation. I will have one week free when this course finishes. This month? Yeah. Well, when do we finish classes? Yeah, this month. And I expect to have one week enough. No, not this one. Perhaps in in two or three weeks I will have one week enough. But the problem is the, the problem is if you have one or three days to take a rest of your work, you really work, you all the time try to get another activity in your house or extra jobs. So yeah, you sure. never take a rest. No, life is expensive. I know, teacher. It's very difficult. Yeah, life is expensive. And I got a teenager, at, well, not a teenager, I got a son at the university, man. That's terrible. And that's thank you. Thank you, Roxana. Nice talking to you. Thank you. Let's see, let's see. Martha. Hello, Martha. Hi, teacher. Good evening. Good evening, Martha. I got a question for you. Hello, can you hear me? Hi, teacher. Okay. Hurt because uh, it's very, 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 very hard. Okay, then don't worry, Marta. I will get back to you at the end of the class because I got a question for you that you are going to help the rest of tell the me, class. Tell okay? me, tell me. I, I, I can hear you. Okay, now it's about the platform. Exercise 2.11, ejercicio 2.11 de la plataforma. Do you remember it? ¿Lo recuerdo? No, but I can't see. It's the one that says, it would be better, would it be better, wouldn't it be better? And it, some it, of the number? And 2.11. Um, yes. What the number? Problem. Okay, let's see. Let me see. Section two, I'm going to get it also here. It's just that uh, uh, you are the only one who got the 100% of the ones who okay. have done it. De los que lo han hecho, la única que no tiene. Okay. The hundred percent. That means that okay. Let's see. I'm going to share with you guys. Hold on, hold on, hold on. We are right here. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Can you see my screen? Yes, I can see you. Okay, I guess this exercise is giving you guys problem. So, this, the apostrophe, I think the apostrophe is the one that uh, is giving you problems because in this exercise, it was, uh, let's see, wouldn't it, wouldn't it be better to, to to revise the manual. Uh, to before revise printing. the manual before printing. Okay. So tell me, you got apostrophe or accent? What did you put? Uh, I think so apostrophe. Okay. It's because uh, I am explaining I am explaining this because it's giving problems to some of you this exercise. And sometimes it can be the, the keyboard. Puede ser el teclado. 
Yes. So we, we check it and to some of you is giving you problems that you cannot get it right. You need to change the keyboard, okay? If anyone's got a problem, let me know. Perhaps we can get somebody from support to help you out with, with, the, with the configuration because uh, if one or two of you got it right, it means that it is possible to get it right as it is, must be the configuration of the keyboard. Well, in let's continue, case, Marta. In my case, I, yes, tell me, tell me. I sort the copy paste because- Oh, really? <laughs> yes, because uh, the error in the platform, I, I, I know the answer is correct. So I copy paste and paste any- and and that's, yes. that's okay for you, it works for you. Yes. <laughs> okay, excellent, I thank you. That. That, that's what I wanted to know. And tell me, Marta, how was your weekend? What did you do? My weekend, it was a very busy teacher, you know. Uh, really, why? So do, uh, and on Saturday, I breakfast with my friend. After that, and in the afternoon, I went drink coffee with my friend in, in my house, um, clean my house. Um, in the Sunday, same schedule, I went to church, I went to supermarket, I washing my series, so I'm very busy. <laughs> you were quite busy, my dear. Yes. Yeah, you were quite but busy, actually. All, Many activities. All okay, all, all okay. Everything was fine. Everything was fine. Yeah, you gotta say it like this. Look, I'm going to text it for everybody. Very easy, everything. but everything was fine. Everything was fine. That's the way we say it. We don't say everything was okay. We don't say everything was well. We say everything was fine. Or yeah, you can say everything was okay. But the most correct is everything was fine. Cool. Excellent. Thank you very much, Martha. Thank you, teacher. Nestor. Hello, Nestor. Hello, teacher. Good evening. I'm sorry, Nestor, just a second. Yes, Fernando, you were asking me? Uh, only only a, an advertisement. There is a blackout yes. here, so. Ooh. So, my, if my you lose mobile connection, connection, I know. <laughs> okay. My mobile I... connection is not good there. Well, so no if, no, if I disappear. I understand it. I understand, it. I understand the reason, okay, no problem. problem. I'll take it. I will take it into an account. I will take it into an account. Let's see, hold on guys. I will take it into an account. This expression, guys, means lo tomaré en cuenta. I will take it into an account. Ah, okay, did you? That expression means I wait for the second for... cuenta. Okay. okay no. I'm waiting for Thank the second for the second attendance before I it's... disappear. Okay, let's do it right now. By the way, ya que me recordó, let's do it right right now. Okay. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Ambar Eli Alfaro Gomez. Present. Thank you, Carlos Antonio Murillo Hernández. Present teacher. Claudia Lizette Ramos Barrientos. Thank you, Claudia. Fernando Marvin Gonzalez Martinez. Present. Thank you. Francisco Eduardo Figueroa Mejía. Present, teacher. José Ernesto Osorio Morán. Present teacher. María Alejandra Barrientos Romero. Present teacher. María Luisa Morales de Corpeño. 
Present teacher. Thank you. Marta Anabelinda Morales de Portillo. Present teacher. Maestro Omar López Castro. Present teacher. Nicolás Apilio Méndez Granados. Present. Roxana Iveda Asensio de Mejía. Present. Thank you. Eh, Silvia Elizabeth Avendaño Pineda. Present. Thank you. Thank you, Daniel. Susana Beatriz Ortiz de Cornejo. Walter Mauricio Morales Araujo. Wilfredo Guardado Rivera. Present teacher. William Giovanni Rosales Galvez. Present teacher. Chanira Elizabeth Asensio García. Present teacher. Thank you. Marcela Margarita Fuentes Nuila. Teacher. Sí. Elizabeth Miranda de Odanes. Present teacher. Fabiola Georgina Silva. Present. Okay, perfect. Let's see, guys. I still got time for a couple of you. Todavía tengo tiempo para un par de ustedes. Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Who else am I going? Oh, I was talking to Nestor. I'm sorry, Nestor. Hello, how are you? <laughs> Hello, teacher. Um, now, uh, I'm a bit stressed because oh, really? I'm still, yes, I'm still working. Oh, yeah, you stay in your workplace, right? Yes, I'm doing a Coast report, which I have to say now. When is the due date? Sorry? I'm asking you because you are telling me that you are working on our report, right? Yes. Yes. Okay. What I'm asking you is this. Uh, when is the due date? My question is, in Spanish will be para cuando es, but actually the correct way is to say uh, cuando es la fecha de entrega. When is the ah, due date? It's today. <laughs> Ooh, okay. You tell me. It is due. It is due today. Okay. It is due today. Ouch. Yeah. Yes. You gotta run. You gotta run. Yes, it, uh, for that reason, um, until now, um, I'm having, I'm having my dinner. Really? Well, enjoy. Yes. Okay, now, we don't say for that reason. Yes, you can say for that reason. Or you can say, okay. actually, the most, the most correct would be, that's the reason. That's the or, reason. <laughs> colloquially, we say, that's why. That's why. Perfect. Es por eso que that's why. Okay. That's why. That way you sound like more normal, okay? Because okay. we don't say we don't we don't usually say that is the reason because of, I mean that's that's uh, it's just that we don't speak like, like that. We don't speak that way. I say that's why. Okay, I understand. Okay. Um, that's why um, I'm having my dinner now, or uh, right now, or at yeah. this moment. Well, enjoy your dinner. Thank you very much, Nestor. Welcome to the class. Don't worry, teacher. Don't worry. Okay, okay. Well, then, if you are available for speaking, tell me what did you do yesterday? Yesterday, yeah. Uh, yesterday, um, I was able to arrange things with my girlfriend. Oh, that's cool. Yes. Yes. That's cool. That's cool. To arrange, so that means uh, actually that would be organizar. Uh, organizar. Entonces es a arreglar o solucionar. Okay. Perfect, you got a nice expression here. Make up. 
Okay. Makeup? Yep, to make up. Okay, I was able to make up things. That is correct? Yes. Okay. Uh, we are angry. <laughs> okay. Angry. I I was I was able to make up with my girlfriend. Okay. 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 That means when you were if you have had a discussion, an argument, and you want to fix things up. Okay. You can say it like this. You can say uh, we fix things up. Oops, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, guys. Uh, no. Like this. We fix things up. We fix things things up okay yeah arreglamos las cosas that's good okay yes that's the best the best things i did yesterday <laughs> that's cool man that's great i mean it's always good to have everything settled down so you can enjoy the time you spend with the person yes it's correct okay tell me now that uh, i want to get into <clears throat> Privacy. How long have you been dating this lady? Um, I I have yes, I have two years ago. Okay, I have been dating her. Okay, I have been dating her two years for ago. Two years for two, for years. two years. Okay, only for two oh, years. Yeah. That's a lot. Yes, yes. I think so. I will marry with her. I will get married. Ah, I will get married with her. Oh, okay. Can I make a joke to you? Sorry? I am. Can I make a joke? Uh, yes. <laughs> I'm so sorry for you, my deepest condolences. Yes, I, I know. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yes, yeah. I know. But uh, uh, no, I want to do cool. it. <laughs> it's cool, it's cool, it's cool. I mean, I've been married for almost 20 years now. Really? Yeah, yeah, I got married when I was 22. Yeah, 22? Oh. Yeah, there's there's people here that I know have been married longer than me. Like Nicolas, Nicolas, how long have you been married? I'm sorry to ask you. Hi. Nicolas, hello. He cannot hear me, I guess. Good evening, oh, teacher. Good evening. How long have you been married, Nicolas? Uh, how have you been married? Yes. Uh, well, I I am married and have uh, three sons. Yes, but how long? Quanto tiempo? Um, mm, well, how many uh, how many years? Quantos años? Well, is is for example. Uh, for the church, I have uh -huh. uh, twenty-two years. Uh -huh. Twenty-two years. Uh, for the, uh, the law, law, for the law, I have twenty twenty-four years. No. Twenty-four. Twenty-five years. Okay. Well, congratulations. Thank you. Is 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 <laughs> Yeah, it, it's actually a struggle. It's a struggle. Struggle. Yeah, struggle. Okay. Yeah. Is 
with my wife uh, are a struggle. Well, thank you very much, Nicolas. Very interesting. So you see, Nestor, I mean, it's it's easy. How old are you, Nestor? Uh, I'm 30 years old. 30? Man, that's cool. Yeah, you are fine to get married. Yes, I'm very young. <laughs> yeah. I mean, it's hard when you get married like I did. I mean, I was, I was 20. No, let's see. <laughs> when did I get married? Yeah, 2002. Yeah, I was 22. My wife was 21. Really? Yep. Oh. Yeah, I mean, we were very... we were pretty young. Oh. Actually, uh, we were many... we were we were in our last year of university. In the last semester. No, after the last semester, yeah. Yeah, we just finished, uh, we finished, uh, no, the problem is this. My son was born right at the beginning of the last semester of the university. Oh, interesting. And, and we got married like, uh, let's see, we, when we got married, my son was like seven months old. So it was how, fun. how many how many songs do you have Kids. just one Kids. Oh, okay just only one, one? yeah one enough more. why why? <laughs> why only one i i got scared me <laughs> asuste i got scared oh. Oh, yeah, okay. I, I mean yeah that was, I mean, it was not possible for us to have more. That's why. No, it's ah, possible. Okay. Yeah. But it's cool, you know. So, congratulations. We hope everything goes good with you. <laughs> thank you. Thank you, teacher. Okay, thank you very much. Okay, guys. Now, let's see. Let's make a review. I've been asking people, what did you do? How was it? How long have you? Okay, we have been using simple past, we have used uh, present perfect, we also use a little bit of comparatives. Okay, now, by the way, you had another homework to bring me. Do you remember? Yes, you were supposed to send me a suggestion. Okay giving me a suggestion for the classes, saying it will be better. Do you remember now? Yes? Okay. Because I mean, from all of you, the only suggestion I have gotten is Fernando's. That's the only suggestion I have gotten. And Fernando's suggestion was like this. I'll share it with you so you can check it out. Fernando told me, my, my suggestion is when the manual conversation is short, it will be better if we repeat it twice. Once as we usually do and again, but we will have to change the role. Wouldn't it be better if we practice the whole conversation and the teacher will evaluate our pronunciation of all the words? Perfectly done, Fernando. Actually, Fernando did even more than what I asked. But you were supposed to send me a suggestion, guys, and nobody did. Just this. So I expect your suggestion for tonight, OK? Please do it. I mean, it's a practice. And the practice, it's good because I can check out how you are doing, if you have really understood the topic. If not, I, I, find, I look for more ways in order to help you out. Now, the activity we are going to do is this, okay? Let me share with you. Uh, uh, whiteboard, okay. Okay, we have a situation. The situation is this. I forgot my father's birthday.
his birthday was yesterday. And I was the only one who did not bring a present. Who did not bring a present. Okay, guys. Now, this is the situation, okay? I have one idea, and my idea is this. I say, hmm, my idea is, uh, I could send him a birthday card. That's my idea. I could send him a birthday card. Now, I need you. I will divide you in small groups. And you are going to give me strong suggestions. And remember, strong suggestions using wouldn't it be better? Okay, you're going to tell me wouldn't. Oops. About wouldn't it be better? Or you're going to tell me it will be better. Okay. Do you understand your activity, guys? You're going to give me strong suggestions. I will send this text for you so you can understand what is the activity, what is the practice. Okay. So, guys, I need you to please. Save my Good life. Time. Yes. I send, it, I send it. I send it to the to the WhatsApp group. Okay. What are you going to do? Give me suggestions. You are going to be working in pairs. Okay. You're going to be working in pairs, and I need you to please give me suggestions. You're going to have four minutes for that activity. Please, let's do it right now. I'm going to divide, to create the groups. Let's see. Okay. Perfect. Oopsie. Okay, groups are created. Please jump in, let's do it. Hey, the teacher uh, need a Nils Nils Nils. How do you say un coscorrón, teacher? Porque se me olvidó. Ah, 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 ah. You are so mean, Marta. I need you to help me, guys. Del popote del chapulí para darle la I'm gone, I'm gone, bye. Es que... Hello. Hola. Hi. Hello. Hola. <laughs> no, le voy a vivir en el chat por si no me escucha. Okay. Hola. Hi. 
Gracias. Teacher. About yes. This. Sorry, I, I just get connection again because I was having this. Oh, okay. If Will you check, repeat, please, the, the exercise? Okay. If you check the WhatsApp, I send you an image. Okay. Okay. And in the image I sent you, uh, it says, I forgot my father's birthday. His birthday was yesterday, and I was the only one who did not bring a present. I could send him a birthday card. You could enviar una tarjeta de cumpleaños. Okay, I need you to please give me suggestions. You said, wouldn't it be better or it will be better? Okay, that's what, what you're going to do. Give me at least two suggestions. Okay. Okay. Okay, teacher. Okay. So you're trying to look. Dollars. Dollars. Teacher is correct. Say, um, wouldn't be better if you if you give a gift card or some dollars or some money some money yeah just yeah, let me wouldn't be better if you give a gift card or some money make uh a dinner, make a dinner and... I don't cook. And... <laughs> Teacher, uh, uh, how do you say? Ah, it's the order and delivery. <laughs> yeah, I will have to. Yeah, you know what's worse? It was his 78, <laughs> his 70th yeah. birthday. Era no 70 años. <laughs> I'm in trouble. I'm in trouble. <laughs> okay, teacher. Uh, in, uh, I think a possible uh, suggestion uh, maybe uh, spend time uh, with 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 him. Spend okay. time, uh, uh, take a, a, a dessert, take a dessert. Okay, Maybe you can it's say it like this. Possibility. You can say it like this, look, pay attention. Can say it like this. Hey, Sylvia. Hi, teacher. Sylvia is very quiet. Ah, uh, now it's raining very heavy here. That's why uh, I'm quiet. Okay, very hard. It's very uh, yeah. It's raining very hard. Yeah. Well, I need you to help me. You know, I'm in trouble right now. Okay. okay, Francisco, the expression is this, you can treat him for a dessert. Treat him means invite him. Or you use that expression, uh, like uh, if I say, oh, I'll treat you to something. But there's a difference. Like when, imagine that I take, uh, I take Sylvia and you for a cup of coffee, okay? We go to a restaurant or for dinner. We invite Sylvia and you tell me, hey, let's invite Sylvia and we'll go, hey, Sylvia, let's go to a restaurant. She says, yes, we go have dinner. And at the moment that you're going to pay, you say, you can say this, look, if you say it's on me, you say, hey, don't worry, it's on me. Or you say, don't worry, my treat, my treat. You are implying that you are going to pay. You are inviting the other person. Oh, okay, 
como decir, yo invito. Yep, exactly. Well, see you guys. I gotta go check another group. Okay, see you. Thanks very much. Okay. Um, bar. Hello. Hello, Amber. How are you? I made my suggestion suggestions. Oh, you are alone. Uh, I have three. Uh, okay, here's Carlos. You can share them to Carlos. Perhaps he can give you an opinion. You got three suggestions. That's cool. You're going to be the first one that I'm going to ask in the group, okay? Okay. So I, I want you to really help me, okay? If not, I'm in trouble. Okay. Hey, Carlos. Hello, teacher. Okay. I have yeah. a connection to this. Okay, but perhaps you can hear Amber's, Amber's uh, pronunciation. Please, Amber, so you can practice. Okay. You would be better in beat. Invite him to a restaurant. Okay. It will be better if you invite him to a restaurant. It, it would be. be better. Yes, it will be better if you invite him to a restaurant. Okay. And recommendation. Uh -huh. No, so, so, uh, Janira's are not good recommendations. She's always getting in trouble. Hey, teacher. No, I tell to Susana that it would be better to take a note in your calendar phone for don't forget again your birthday's father. Okay, for not forgetting. For not, yeah, for not forgetting. Or yeah. bring, bring her, bring him to take a, a dinner birthday, for example. Pay him for a birthday for a birthday dinner. For a birthday dinner, or Susana Pay say him. yes, yes. Or Susana say that uh, says Susana says, says Susana says bring a uh, mariachis if your father like you. It's funny. My father, my father used to like mariachis when he was young but only when he was drinking. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I but don't like now, the mariachi. <laughs> but, but now he, he's been, he stopped drinking 26 years ago. Oh, it's a long time. Yeah, he stopped completely. Okay, okay, nice. That's fight for him. Yeah, yeah. It, it's cool. My father too stopped to, to drink. Uh, maybe stop drink. drinking. Is, is stop drinking. Yes. Maybe. Remember, Janita, please, please, please. I'm sorry. I'm sorry to interrupt. Remember. Okay. For start, stop, like, go. If you place a verb right next to them, that verb goes in ing. Stop. Drinking, start drinking, go drinking. Okay, okay. Okay, remember, okay, that's okay. the gerund. <laughs> yeah, I forgot, teacher. Thank you for remember. Reminding me. Reminding. So your father stopped drinking a long while ago also. Yes, maybe 22 years ago. Oh, yeah, a long while ago. Yeah. Yeah, that's cool. It's better for your health. Of course, yes. Yeah, that's yes, why it didn't stop because it's not better for mine, it's better for yours. I'm kidding. <laughs> and just okay, have... me. Yeah. Ooh. Well, Ooh. I stopped I stopped drinking on Saturday. <laughs> Come on, teacher. But yeah, you because, drink because I ran out. Listen, listen, listen. I stopped last Saturday 
because I ran out. Se me acabó. Run out. Ah, yeah. Because you don't out. Because you I ran out. No, nah, not really. Not okay. Really. Not really. I mean, uh, uh, I mean, you drink. Actually, I you drink have, regularly. I, no, once in a while. I mean, on a Saturday or a Sunday, perhaps uh, one or two beers or one or if it's at night, I rather have a, a shot. And I mean, I got one shot of, of whiskey or perhaps gin or ginebra. And wine? Something like that. Yeah, I got wine also. I don't think we know that. Okay, I mean, or, or sangria? No, the thing is this, when we, when we uncork a, a, a bottle of wine, what we do is uh, my son and my wife, they cook little snacks like tapas. Ah, okay, okay. So, yeah, maybe for the, the, gest the digestion. Well, actually that's mm, here because they prepare a lot. <laughs> okay okay yeah like like my favorite is like uh, fried cheese i love fried cheese fried cheese yes with wine i love fried cheese oh really yes and if it's just a cup of wine i like it with chocolate with chocolate yeah the, the candy the Ah, okay, okay, okay. You combine chocolate and wine. Yeah, yeah. really. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Nice taste. Interesting. I never listened to this. I, I uh, listen cheese and wine, but no uh, wine and chocolate. It's good. Also, uh, jamón serrano and wine. Oh, oh yeah, yes. I, I, I listen uh, cheese and... How to say embutidos? I don't know. If sausages. In, in, sausages. Sausages. Sausages and ham, but yeah. never listen a uh, chocolate with wine. Yeah, you get a, the first time. a chocolate, you bite it, then you taste the wine and you feel like the taste explodes in your mouth. It's good. Mm -hmm. Nice. Nice. Interesting. Yeah, let's go back. It's time. Okay, bye. So Walter, how was the game? Did you win? Oh my God, teacher, it's a, 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 lot of, a lot of wine. Okay, yes, Walter, you say it like this. Remember, remember Madison? You say it's raining cats it's raining. and dogs. Decimos, it's raining cats and dogs. It's raining cats and dogs. Yeah, okay. that means that it's raining pretty hard. Okay, thank you, teacher. You're welcome. And tell me, did you win the game yesterday? Ganaron? Ah, yes. Yes. Oh, cool. <laughs> and That's nice. That's nice. The, and the plan is perfect. Uh, the weekend. Okay, cool. Glad to oh. hear that. Uh, we went. Uh, we went. My family and the visit and the visit the beach. La Libertad. Ooh. Yes, Ooh. I recommend them. <laughs> excellent, excellent. Thank I you recommend. very much, Walter. Okay, Walter. thank you, teacher. You're welcome. So, Ambar, your suggestion, please give me one. Okay, teacher, give me one second. It passed already. Ya pasó. I'm kidding. Okay. 
It would be better if you invite him to a restaurant. Invite, invite. Invite, invite him to a restaurant. Okay. And what do you recommend? A lunch or a dinner? What would it be better? Mm, I prefer a dinner because it's, it's better for me. And okay. I, I think that uh, the person, how do you say, la persona lo reconocería o le parecería bien? Enjoy. Enjoy. Uh, the person enjoy it, the dinner. Okay, or you can say enjoy the gesture, el gesto. Enjoy the gesture. Gesture. Okay, well, thank you. I'll take it into an account. I keep it in mind. Okay, teacher. <laughs> thank you very much. Let's see, let's see. Maria Alejandra, what do you think? <laughs> teacher. <laughs> Uh, I think that first of all, uh, maybe it would be very great remembers in your calendar form. <laughs> okay, okay. It would be better to create reminders. Ah, uh, reminders. Okay, now give me the, another suggestion. <laughs> Uh, Marta and me and I, I think it would be better give apologize and get out with a, along with your father uh, for dinner or I don't know. And then and uh, spend your time with him. That's interesting. Let's see. Last time my dad and me were alone was like more than 20 years ago. That is a good idea. You spend your time with him and mm -hmm. I don't know, for the recuerdos? <laughs> for memories. For memories. <laughs> the the bro, it's a good suggestion. It's a good suggestion. The problem is that we don't really talk that much with my dad. We are not uh, affected people. Mm. We are yeah. both. We are both. When whenever we are together, we are both very very serious to uh. each other and very and we are pretty formal to each other. Uh, okay, and um, it um, carry your mother. <laughs> Yeah, take, take, take. no carry. Yeah, okay. carry. Carry means like this. Ah, okay. And and I couldn't carry my mom. My mom weighs 220 pounds. Uh, okay. Okay, yeah, but I to invite I wouldn't be able. Invite to more at your mother um, at the dinner <laughs> and your Thank past. You. Excellent, excellent. Thank you very much, Mariela. Welcome, teacher. Sylvia, what about you? What do you think? Hello, teacher. Um, I think, uh, oh, wouldn't it be better if, if you, uh, if you get a cake, if, if you give a cake to your father and bring some gloves and sing the happy birthday? I hate happy birthday song. Hmm. You could try. Yeah. yeah, but I have to do it. I have to do it. Yeah, yeah. a cake. Well, I, I actually would need a cake for, for diabetics, a sugarless cake. Okay. Where do I get that? I mean, I love sugar. Thank you very much, Sylvia. Interesting. Francisco, what do you think? Man, Francisco is working. Yes, teacher. Work. Okay. Do you have any suggestion for me, Francisco? Yeah. 
the teacher selection uh, is if we will be able to treat him uh, this year and, and spend time with him. And other suggestion uh, is it will be better if uh, take your father to a place he has never decided. Visit it. Decided. Visit it. Perfect. Thank you very much. Okay, guys, everybody look out the, the, the Zoom chat to treat him for a dessert. Treat, invitat. Okay. To treat him for a dessert. And I was explaining to Francisco also that if we are in a dinner and you are going to say, hey, look, guys, I'm going to pay. You don't say, hey, I'm going to pay. You say, hey. My treat. Yo pago. Okay. Or you say it's on me. It means the same. Yo pago in that context. Okay. Thank you very much, Francisco. Excellent. Janira, talk to me. Well, we think in uh, some suggestion like. Um, Alejandra and Amber, uh, we told you that you can, it would be better take a note in your calendar, uh, calendar phone for reminding and never forget again your father, father birthday. Or, okay. or maybe you, you, Treat him for a for a dinner birthday, or maybe okay. you can I don't know buy a a, a gift for your father if okay. he has a weird just like you. It's easy for you. <laughs> okay, cool. Thank you very much. Excellent. Okay, Selena. teacher. Thank you. Yeah, no, I'm sorry, Janita. It's just that it's my sister's job to remind me of everybody's birthday. Yes, it is. It's her job. I always forget. I don't know my mom's birthday. I don't know my father's birthday. I don't know my wife's birthday. Here's your, your, calendar, your, your calendar. And I forget always to check the calendar. Yes, a teacher. Come on. Yeah. yeah, well, little details. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Who else got suggestions for me? We still got time. Carlos, Carlos, you haven't talked to me. Tell me, what do you suggest? Okay, like uh Madeline that uh, I I will be there say in that moment. Oh, I have a surprise for you. <laughs> I'm inviting you to go out and take okay. a day off in the beach, for example. Okay, that's nice. That's nice to save the moment and say, "Eh, no, mine is a surprise, and it's going to be for later." Yeah. That's cool. Yeah, that's a good way. I mean, you can get free for, with that one. That's nice. I'll keep it in mind. Thank you. Let's see. Let's see. Wilfredo, what do you suggest, man? We told with Walter and Osorio that a good suggestion could be first give him some apologies because you forgot this important date. Then you can call and call him and tell him maybe uh, I'm sorry, but I want to have a little time with you. Would you go with? Do you want to go tomorrow? To some restaurant or for for lunch or for dinner, maybe it could be idea. Interesting. And Thank you very much. Yes, yes. Tell me, another, tell me, tell me. Yeah, and another teacher could be that you can call in and invite him to, or you can go to your 
his home and maybe offer offer him a, a dinner in his home and give some present for him. Okay, well, yeah, it's acceptable. I guess. Very interesting. Thank you very much. Appreciate You're it. Welcome. Now let's see. Now it was not that important. You know, it was just his 70th birthday. So no big deal. I'm in trouble. Let's see. Let's see. Who else? Who else? Who else? Um, Jensi, Jensi, you've been quiet tonight. Tell me. Talk to me. You have to me, teacher. Okay. Please tell me what's your suggestion. Give me one. One, um, I think um, it would be better if you talk with him and share different stories while you drink a coffee. Can be a good time with him. Can you have a good time with him? And apologize to him. <laughs> um, well, yeah. I know. Thank you. Excellent, Jesse. Okay. Great, great. Fabiola, your turn, please. Help me out. It will be a bear take. Will treat his favorite restaurant. And oh, it oh. will. Mm -hmm. It would be nice to buy his favorite, <gasps> favorite food. Yeah. I don't know. Wow. I don't know his favorite restaurant nor his favorite food. Well, I could ask my mom. Uh, that would work. Thank you very much, Fabiola. Excellent. <laughs> Let's see. Marcela, what about you? What do you think? I think, uh, I think it be birthday. Uh, thank you. 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 Is it the pueblitos? Okay. <laughs> it's very... Okay, thank you very much, Marcela. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Let's see. I still got time, got time, got time, got time. Let's see. Daniel, I think it's not available. Claudia, what about you? Can you hear me now? Yes, teacher. Oh, perfect. Great. Okay, I think that it's it will be better to give um to give him a trip. Okay. Um with her wife, maybe. His wife. A second. Okay, his wife. A second honeymoon, maybe. <laughs> my dad and my mom, they never <laughs> home. They live in a second honeymoon. Esos dos así viven. They are never home. Okay. They're all, Be yeah, but uh, I, could, I could think about something like that. <laughs> Thank you, Claudia. Okay, please. Yeah, my old men, they are always going somewhere, visiting somebody, I mean, every week and they go out. Let's see, let's see. Walter, give me a suggestion. Help me out. What you got for me? Okay, teacher. Uh, my partners and within, uh, I will be better if you give him dinner tomorrow night. Oh, no, no, tomorrow, one night, because if one, I give him dinner tomorrow <laughs> night, you don't have class. Excuse me, excuse me. <laughs> and tonight. Okay, um, perfect. Yeah, but to take him out for dinner any given night, that's excellent. Thank you very much, Walter. 
Welcome. Nicolás, what you got from me, Nicolás? Well, uh, the, the surgeon is... Suggestion. To, the suggestion is it will be better invite him to dinner the next Saturday, Saturday. Okay, invite, invite. Invite him to okay. dinner tomorrow, uh, the next Saturday. Okay, excellent. Thank you. Great. Let's see, Nestor, what you got for me? Hi, teacher. Um, I think you first, um, you first uh, apologize with your father. Apologize. Um, apologize, sorry with your father and I think the car is a good idea um, and I think he will be happy but uh, would it be better to take him on a trip um, maybe to Cerro Verde oh, uh, so it would be better to to be able to spend time together uh, with nature nature yeah they love Only camping. That. Yeah, you are right. They love camping. I hate camping. But it's <laughs> nice. <laughs> we can make it okay. work. We can make it work. Thank you very much. Let's okay, see. Let's pleasure. see. Let's see. Jose. Jose Sorio. What do you think? Hi, teacher. Can you repeat me, please? What do you think? What's your suggestion? What do uh, I do? It's my suggestion. Yep. Is relate uh, with Fredo. Say it would be better if you gave him a dinner tomorrow because we thought in in that because it's it a good way to spend quality time with his, with your father teacher okay to spend and, quality and, time excellent and yes an opportunity to show him how much you love him and no matter that is was not yesterday okay yeah. the part of show him and expressing feelings is interesting that's actually the big the big the big thing thank you very much hey guys thanks very much to all of you you did a pretty good job it was a great job the one that you did giving the suggestion and i can say that uh you have made an excellent exercises you got a good command of the expression will be better remember will be better is used for giving strong suggestions let me share something with you. Remember, we are talking in the, in the Instafor manual in page number 22. It says, will better be used to, to express a strong, strong advice or suggestion. Okay. And depending on the situation, it can be considered as a criticism. Okay. So look at examples. It will be better to let employees decide what processes to change. It will be better to let a manager take care of the situation. Other expressions to provide suggestions or alternatives. Would you prefer, wouldn't it be better to, it will be good if, it will be good if we have a, prof if we had a professional to complete the manual. Now, page number 22, Exercise five is a homework for you. Please send me the sentences. Okay, I need you to send me the sentences, please. Okay, follow the example. Would you prefer to have a different schedule? You see, that's what we are going to do. Page number 22, exercise five. That's the homework for you. I need you to please, before the class tomorrow, you send it to me, okay? Any question about the homework? Nope. Teacher, yes. Juliana, Juliana, he said, 
Hoy le comentaba, ¿verdad? pero en la plataforma me salen malas, solo dos. Oh, la dos, oh yeah. La dos y la cinco. Yes, eh, como comentábamos, este, parte de la clase, eh, perdón que pase al español, en este caso lo que estamos teniendo problema es con el apóstrofe. Puede ser que necesitemos cambiar el, el formato del teclado. Déjenme consultar mañana cómo le, si hay posibilidad de que uno de los chicos de soporte le pueda ayudar. Solamente me dice mañana cuál es el horario en el cual usted puede, pueden ellos comunicarse con usted. Ok. Thank you. Me manda la información en un mensaje. Thank okay. you very much. Now, for tomorrow's homework, any question? No? Okay, now, I will give the, the, the ads. Uh, please remember, on Wednesday, we finish section number two. That means that for Wednesday, we need to have finished section number two and midterm. Don't forget, section two and the midterm, the exam and the midterm, needs to be done for Wednesday at night, para el miércoles por la noche, okay? So please, if you haven't worked on it, advance a little bit, because, let me see, according to my register, let's see, I'll let you know, uh, According to my information, just give me a second. Let's see, just one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Just eight of you have finished the section number two. And the midterm exam, I got just two persons. Let me see. The midterm, two, three, four, five of you are the ones who have finished. I just have five who have already finished the midterm and six who have finished section number two. But the rest are still are working on it. I can see the ones who, have, who, who are already working on the platform. That's great. Remember, just in the case of uh, that little question that uh, we were talking before is the one that is giving problems for the apostrophe. If you have any other trouble, please let me know as soon as you find it because that way I can report it or I can help you out. Let's see, any question guys? About the activity, about the homework? No? Yes? Okay, let me get the final attendance. No, teacher, so, it's okay. Thank you very much. Appreciate it, Jenny. Let me get the final attendance so you can go to sleep and rest. Amber Eli Alfaro Gomez. Present. Thank you, Amber. Appreciate it. Carlos Antonio Murillo. Present teacher. Claudia Elizabeth Ramos Barrientos. Thank you, Claudia. Daniel Eduardo Segueda Valencia. Thank you, Daniel. Fernando Marvin Gonzalez Martinez. Oh, he disconnected due to the storm. Francisco Eduardo. Oh, there's Francisco. Francisco Eduardo Figueroa Mejía. Present. Thank you. Jose Ernesto Osorio Morán. Present teacher. María Alejandra Barrientos Romero. Present teacher. María Luisa Morales de Corpeño. Marta Ana Belinda Morales de Portillo. Present teacher. Néstor Omar López Castro. Present teacher. Nicolás Atilio Méndez Granados. Present. Roxana Ived Asensio de Mejía. Present. Silvia Elizabeth Avendaño Pineda. Present. Susana Beatriz Ortiz de Cornejo. Present teacher. Walter Mauricio Morales Araujo. Present teacher. Wilfredo Guardado Rivera. Present teacher. William Giovanni Rosales Galvez. Present teacher. 
Yanira Elizabeth Asensio García. Present teacher. Marcela Margarita Fuentes Milo. Present teacher. Jensi Elizabeth Miranda de Udanes. Present teacher. Fabiola Georgina Silva. Present. Thank you very much and have a good night, guys. See you tomorrow. Bye bye. Bye. See you tomorrow. Bye, guys. Take care. Bye. Tomorrow, see you. Okay, I forget it. <laughs> I'm sorry. No problem, no problem. We will talk about it later, okay? Okay. Now, but right now I need to do us to have a small conversation with you. Okay? okay. Because I would like to evaluate your level of English and your pronunciation and your fluency. So tell me, what is the position you are applying for your new job? Uh, for the new job, I will to apply Oh, to accounting associated. Okay. Associated. Um, yes, an accounting I, associated. What's your experience in that area? I have I have experience in accounting payables, but knowing or the process about the uh, processes. Uh, processes about the um, all the operation. Uh, all the time, um, I was working in um, big companies. So, so uh, when I when I was young, I was working in a little uh, company. But then, uh, small I, company. A small company. But then I was working in a big comp and a big company. Sorry, uh, for that. For, it, it's that's the reason. Why. That's why. That's why. I have experience just in a part of the processes. In my case, okay. accounting payable. So I have a lot of experience with uh, taxes or or uh, some uh, processes in other countries. In my case, uh, I was working with um, USA, uh, Brazil, um, Spain, Brazil. 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 Brazil, Spain, and Colombia, and others. So I had a lot of experience with uh, accounting about another countries, not uh, other countries, other, other countries. countries, not uh, here, not no, just not El Salvador. Salvador, not just El Salvador. Yeah. Okay, very interesting. Now tell me, how long have you been working for your current company? I was working in my current company around eight I've been, months. I've been, I've been. I've been, I have been, Joel, I have been. I have been yes. working, working. Working. I have been working in my current company around eight months, I, I guess. Okay, and in the previous one? In the previous one, I was where I, I have working. No, I was, I was I for. Was, uh, I I was uh, working. Hold on, hold on. For. In the previous one, I was for two years, or I was there for two years. I was there for five years. Okay. Okay. I was uh, there for six years. Okay. Perfect. And Excellent. Yes. And I and I was working in a accounting payable, so it's my uh, bigger payable payable accounts. Mm, payable accounts. Cuenta por pagar. Uh huh. Uh -huh. Payable accounts. Me recuerdo accounting payable because in some reports I check it and I read accounting payable. Yeah, but the proper one should be payable accounts. 
Bueno, pero esto sería pay all accounts. Bueno. Pay all accounts. Yeah. But let me check on something. Vamos a solo revisar algo. Let, I will check the term. Voy a revisar el término. Okay. Okay. I got some material. Now, tell me. And you are in, an, in, a, in a job interview right now. Okay. Estoy entrevistando para el trabajo. If you have noticed, those are the type of questions you get, right? Yeah. Okay. Now, tell me. Why would you like to work in this company? <laughs> uh... No sé, teacher, no he estudiado así. No, why would you like to work for this company? Eh, uh, that's, a, that's a commonplace question. Why? La pregunta yes, es por why. qué. Yes. Eh, I want, sería, podría contestar con yo quiero. Yes, I want. I want to uh, work here because I have a lot of... Um, Como, eh, no, sí, pero lo iba a enfocar oh, I would a like crecimiento. To, I would like to grow in my, professional, would, in my professional self. I would in like. Pro, yes, I would like to grow in my professional self. In my professional Professional self. Self. Okay. En mi crecimiento profesional. Sí, sí, así sería en mi professional self. I would like, like to work here. No, yes. To grow para crecer in my professional self. Mm -hmm. To grow in my professional self. To grow in my professional self. And I have a lot of experience in uh, the area. And I area, 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 area. And I think that I I can um, apply that. Apply, apply that? Apply that? I can apply for it. I can apply for it in this company. I can apply for it in this company. And okay, please tell me a little bit about yourself. When eh, lo voy a decir en español. Cuando hacen esa pregunta, entiendo que no es precisamente sobre sobre mí misma, sino, o sea, mi vida como tal, sino mi área profesional, ¿cierto? No necesario. Depende. Si la entrevista al personal de recursos humanos, depende de, en algunas posiciones, uno pasa por varias entrevistas. Uh -huh. If you are interviewed by human resources, usually in human resources, you start like, look, okay, if you ask, ask me, please, the question. Uh, tell me about uh, yourself. Uh, you, do you live with your family? Okay. Or... Uh, 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 uh. No. I just ask you. Could you please tell me a little bit about yourself? And you start like, oh, well, yeah, my name is Julio Cerevalo. I am 41 years old and I, I am an English teacher. I've been an English teacher for 21 years now. And I have, I started teaching at Universidad Pedagogica El Salvador in the year 2000. And I have taught for private and public schools and also for English academies. I was working also for, for one year and a half. I was working at Universidad Don Bosco. And I've been a, a facilitator for in support courses in different English programs. The, one of them is the English for Work program, but not the only one I have worked with. And I enjoy working with others. Teaching others is what I like the most, even though I teach youngsters, teenagers, 
And let's see, I like to be, even though in my normal life, I'm a pretty serious person, whenever I get into a classroom or in a class, I don't know, something in me changes. A switch gets turned on and I become more effable, you know, like talkative, like I joke and I, actually if I am in a classroom, I'm always in movement, okay? I use a lot my body to talk and I enjoy what I do. I like to, I like to work in individually and also I love working in teams. It's fine, I like dealing with people. For me, that's something very important. And I try to be responsible and punctual because I like people to be responsible and punctual with me. Also, uh, I tend to be very ordered. I like processes and I like instructions to be clear for me so I can fulfill all my assignments because I don't like to be called off for not doing something in the way it should be. You see, I have covered all the areas. Mm -hmm. Personal, how do I describe myself, my studies? And I can continue, I can say, oh, well, also I have been, I've been trained in different areas for teaching, like uh, methodologies and resources. I got, I am certified by, I am certified by uh, Google Classrooms program. I am certified in Moodle platform. And I have been teaching in Zoom. I, I know Zoom, I've been teaching in Google Classroom, as I told you, in Microsoft, in the Microsoft platform too, Microsoft Teams, and working in working in online is very interesting. It has allowed me to to get better and to look for new resources. Also, in my studies, uh, I am certified with IC3 certifying. That's for computers. And I didn't finish the master in Microsoft due to a uh, change in my jobs, my workplaces, but I work a lot with Excel, Word, PowerPoint. Oh, I know Office and a little bit of date, databases. And in the English area, let's see, I was uh, in TOEFL, I am in advanced level. I got 600 up from 650, I don't know the 650. And in TOEIC, I got a perfect score. I got all the points, 995 out of 995. Okay, so you see, I there I cover everything. So. Ya me asusté. Why? <laughs> I don't know. Okay, it's simple. We are going to work. To get you there. Vamos a trabajar para llevarla ahí. Okay. Mm -hmm. Just okay. Let's see. Let's see, Roxana. I expect to have been of help. Espero haber recibido de ayuda. Mucho. Vale. And we'll get in contact. We'll get in contact. Okay. okay? Thank Have you. Good teacher. night. Bye bye. Good night.